Okay. All right. So, <laughs> uh, this is going to be a bonus, Cancer, because I, I was doing a reading and then it cut out when I did these. Okay. So, let's go through this real quick. Okay. This is Cancer. Okay. So, a uh, message from your person. Okay. First, let's start as okay. It's all possible for you. Okay. Whatever you're doing and so much more is possible. You're perfect just as you are, right? Okay, so it's okay if you're uh, having crown games or whatever, right? <laughs> just, you know, just accept yourself with that uh, radical self-acceptance and unconditional love for yourself. Okay, and others. Be two things, who and what you want. I feel like you're doing that already. You are amazing. Okay. This was from your person that you're not communicating with for one person. Have a spectacular day. Okay. And every day with you is another adventure. This is how they look forward to being with you when they are with you. Okay. And I'm so glad I found you. Okay. This is the same person. Okay. She believed she could, so she worked her ass off, and she did. And there are two things that were coming up with this. I feel like your person is trying to prove to you that she's worthy of you. Okay, now, with that said, the other thing is, I feel like because you work hard, you feel like, um, now this could be flip, but, uh, you work hard, so you feel like other people should too. Okay. But it's just two ways of being. Some people get more done. They feel like through this, uh, ether energy and some people feel like they get more accomplished by doing it. Right. Eventually there has to be doing in this physical reality, but, um, Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot. Okay. So you want to watch out for that if that resonates, because if you're judging other people, that lowers your vibration. Okay. That can lower your vibration for you to have, uh, so the out outcomes of things can come out lower if, if you keep doing that. Okay. So you want to move out of that, especially if this person is uh, like that twin flame energy and it's going to the next level, then you want to move out of that. Okay. Judgment, because that could affect, like if you're doing that at work, it could affect it when you come home or if you're doing it to your person, then that could lower the connection. So you want to, uh, switch that up. And then here is look forward, not back for those of you who are going solo now. Okay, and keep on moving. Trust yourself and trust your own energy and trust your inner guidance and the impulses that come. You are tenacious. Okay, let's get another one. I like those. Feeling good. Buy the ticket, take a ride. Okay, so that's a message for someone. It's like, okay... So whatever you've been hoping to uh, journey, right, in your experience, it's the suggestion is just do it. Like the, and the, they're giving me Nike symbol. Okay, just do it. Buy the ticket, take a ride. Go get them. <laughs> so this might be someone who's been solo for a long time. Okay. Look how you shine, darling. Okay. I feel like for those of you who have a partner, uh, that's how they see you as this bright and shiny uh, being. Okay, so you are something special. And this is from the water sign. Okay, and uh, okay, so then let's, since we're here and we're already doing another reading, I need to go get another SD card. That's what it is. I forgot. <laughs> okay, I've been doing a lot. Okay, so. Yeah, I didn't get to bed till like after three. All right, anyway, okay, so let's keep going. Let's look into July real quick. Okay. 
Bright heart light. Okay, so yeah, that's how they see you too. Okay. Divine masculine power, electric active power. Okay, so what I'm getting here is some people might be working in the field of electricity, like electrician or um, something that has to do with that. Okay, now this is... Whoever this is, this is someone who really likes what they're doing, their work. They love it. Okay. All right, so you want to... This is like your new way of being, open-hearted. Okay, and moving in forward in action uh, in your work, in your love, in this energy. Portal, infinite mind, awakening consciousness. So this is like the infinity symbol. Tapping into infinite intelligence. Okay, and here's the unity energy. And here's a portal. Okay, so that's interesting. That's like the wheel, but it's like a bunch of triangles. So you might be going towards a collaboration with a Gemini or Libra like that energy or an air sign. Or it could be just, um, it could be uh, anyone in high, that high vibing energy. Okay, because I feel like this is like looking like a lamprey to me too. Okay, so what is that? Hold on. Okay, so lamprey, I'm getting like sucking energy or siphoning or sucking. Oh, maybe that's what that pirate was showing up in your other reading. Okay, so maybe you feel like someone is, okay, well, I don't want to say this, but it feels like leech energy. Okay, so, but leech, people use leech for uh, an old ancient medicine, right? Okay, so it's like... Uh, think we've uh, gone away from that okay so but that's probably a good thing <laughs> okay but okay so um but I feel like there's someone in your energy I feel like that for someone you feel like there's that energy okay so Okay, so, but I feel like you've been able to rise above whatever that thought was and uh, able to bring in uh, a higher vision. Okay, so it's, this is like reassessing again, the past stuff. Okay, and looking at your initiatives. Am I moving in the direction I want? Is there something more I can reach for? That kind of question. Okay, and then raising your energy to go through this high high energy <clears throat> oh i'm seeing this as a jellyfish okay so it could be a water sign that you're going towards or someone with uh emotions or emotional intelligence someone who's in who taps into the infinite mind okay and this coming into contact with this person uh, has opened up some stuff energetically, if you like. Okay. Because I feel like that person is unapologetically them, right? No matter what things or restrictions, for this is for someone that you imposed on them, they still uh, had a kind of uh, determination to be, be them. And I feel like they've actually um, did, oh yeah, okay, so did I say this? They were trying to prove to you with this energy, where was that? Okay, mermaid wanted to come out, so maybe that is a water sign. Okay, so, uh, but anyway, that one card, oh, where did, oh, here it is, okay. I feel like that person wants to prove to you that they're a hard worker. Okay, this one right here. 
Okay, so. I feel like they feel like they have to prove something to you. Okay, now. Let's keep going. Abundance. Yeah, I, they want to show to you uh, their courage, their abundance, their blessings. But somehow it got lost in translation here with hostilities, conflict, and unrest. Okay, so it's, this is healing earth reverse, so it might be a water sign here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. That's polar opposite. Okay. All right, so, but what they were reaching for in, this is for someone, in separation, they were reaching for this. Healing self and others, right? Changing generational patterns from the past. Looking forward and not looking back. Okay. Now, for some of you, you came into contact with this energy that had someone had loss, lack, fear, victimization mentality. And I feel like on some level, you are probably, uh, some, some Cancerians were reflecting that back. Okay, also. Okay. And then there was a call for an adjustment in your energy here. Okay, so looking back once for all and moving forward. You got two cards looking forward, right? Yeah, you did. somewhere <laughs> okay anyway okay so grateful op optimism to bring in your abundance here fortune wealth and plenty okay i feel like in the past you use pessimism to kind of fuel things okay because i'm getting like this lit up uh fan here okay well, so this, then if you, this is like, uh, it doesn't matter what charge it is, negative or positive, it's still attention, that kind of energy. Okay, so that's what came up in the first reading right before we closed out, or the camera closed out by itself. <laughs> okay, so, but anyway, I feel like now you have a joyous view. It was a journey, right? View of the future. You have hope. You have optimism, and that is going to bring in this abundance, fortune, wealth, and plenty again. The resupply, right? Okay, so because some of you, um, okay, so invested some monies in places. So now you're waiting for um, the harvest. Okay. You're giving me, um, yeah, okay. Okay, so here's the four. Now, this is four for me is love, right? So what's important is moving with your wisdom with that. Okay, and summoning power, instinct, intellect, and control. Okay, so I feel like you have the ability to ra rally people together for your cause. Now, the thing that you want to watch out for, since in the first part, this crown games came out in the last, so you want to kind of, Flow, get in flow state and then you won't feel like any you have to hyper control things okay brilliant beliefs okay so taking reassessing okay so when you go back and reassess your work stuff go back and reassess your beliefs are my beliefs working for me Right, my old belief system. Are there some things I can tweak to make this nine cycle go to the next phase? Okay. Luminous life force, personal power, sensual feminine energy, sensuality. I feel like this is your energy, feeling passionate, balanced out with that masculine and feminine divine. Okay, because you got masculine in the center of your reading. And then here is the feminine, wisdom and passion, 
which is important to move with this love energy. All right. Now, okay, and that brings balance, stability, standing firm, and building your world. Okay, creation, expansion, networking. And here comes the river, the flow state, right? Okay, the flow state, river of blessings and releasing constraints of the past once and for all. I'll leave you with that. Thank you, Cancer.